Hi, I'm Mike Massimino, and this is Inside the International Space Station. All right, any Santa Claus sightings when you're looking out the window, looking out the cupola? Yeah, I was the Grinch this year. Mike, you're kind of like a bad penny. And I am inside the flight control room, and we're getting ready to speak to Dan Burbank and Don Pettit. They're in space, and we're going to see what they're up to. Hey, Don and uh, Dan, how do you hear? Hey, Master, we got you loud and clear. Okay, we got you the same. You're up on the big screen. You guys look great. Happy New Year. And uh, that's one thing we wanted to talk to you about. We've got this new new year here just started, and you guys are up uh, in space for the holidays. What did you guys do for the holidays? How did you, uh, how'd you spend them? Well, probably like we would have done on the ground. We ate an awful lot, and uh, <laughs> we spent a lot of time together, had a lot of meals together, spent a little bit of time looking out the window, and uh, worked on some things. Uh, yeah, we, we had a, a fair amount of little tasks that showed up on the timeline, and we uh, uh, worked through those as quick as we could, and then we got back to doing a bit of celebration. How did you handle, how'd you handle the holiday shopping? I mean, you know, you've got, uh, was it all online? What did you do? Did you have little elves to help you out on the ground? What, what happened? Uh, that's easy. I was the Grinch this year. <laughs> Uh, I, be, before I blasted off, I gave uh, my wife my credit card, so uh, I, I'm letting her take care of all of that. And uh, I've, I've just been so involved with getting ready for this mission that uh, the buying gifts just kind of fell off the edge of the, the, the universe. Yeah, I, I guess if you have um, a good excuse, uh, being in space is probably one of them. And I, th I think my wife has my credit cards all the time, so, so it, was, uh, it was great. Now, one thing that my wife doesn't realize, since I'm going to be gone for a while, not only does she have the credit card, but she's going to have to deal with the bill that comes, too. <laughs> okay. All right, any Santa Claus sightings when you're looking out the window, looking out the cupola? Uh, none, none, no Santa Claus sightings at all, but we know NORAD was tracking him, and uh, we did keep our eyes out, but uh, I think, uh, I think we, he, he squeaked by uh, without us seeing him this year. And we've got this new infrared camera, and I was taking pictures of the comet Lovejoy, and I noticed this little blip in the comet tail, and I and that only showed up in the infrared signature, and I think that must have been Santa Claus's sled. Could have been Rudolph. It could have been Rudolph. Yeah. You know, his nose blinks in the infrared as well. There, there you have it, kids. All right, guys, I tell you what, you know, this is kind of like a, a holiday show because it's just after the holidays, and just like any good holiday show, that has special guests. We have a special guest for you right here. Can you see him? Here's your special Hey, Don, Dan, it's a, guest. Mike Fossum here with you. The place looks great up there, guys. We left it a mess. And you've been doing a lot of cleanup. Nice job. Hey, we, you know, Mike, uh, Mike, you're kind of like a bad penny. You just keep showing up and showing up. And I'll tell you, it sure is welcome to, to hear your voice and now uh, see your smiling face. Hey, it's great to see you guys on the big board here, and uh, I'm sorry, once again, we just had a few days worth of handover with Dan there, so I'm really sorry about the, the mess we left the place, buddy. I know what it was like as uh, you uh, got us, uh, bu you know, packed up and out the door after just being there four days yourself. I, actually, we, you know, the, the beauty of the way we did this is we started our handover like months before, so uh, you, were, you were training and training me and handing over to me for, uh, for many weeks before I got here, and then it was kind of that whirlwind couple of days that we had, and uh, you've always been a phone call away, and, uh, and that's been a huge help. Hey, you guys are looking great. I wish I was there with you.